it's called the name of the new thing Paxi's announcement it's a fucking card game all right well you know what I just got back okay I just returned from Pax East and for those of you who aren't aware Okay, this previous upcoming week and weeks before that as well, uh, Blizzard representatives were hyping something up quite quite big, and there was a lot of talk, a lot of a lot of rumors, Warcraft Four, you know, Diablo Three expansion, Titan stuff. Uh, they dispelled these pretty quick, so a lot of people were saying, "Well, what could it possibly be?" You know, like who knows. And here's the announcement. It is called Hearthstone Heroes of Warcraft, essentially a Warcraft card game that is not the WoW TCG that is already out. Uh, This is entirely separate. Um, I'm a bit taken aback. Uh, A bit taken aback, to be honest with you, but I'm going to try to give my uh, concise opinions on the overall scope, the goals, and, you know, how it's going to pan out. All right, so let's 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 do that, shall we? Let's. I think we shall. All right, let's start by let's begin at the beginning, shall we? If you will, the announcement was, as I've said already now, a, a card game. It's not a trading card game. Uh, people are calling it a trading card game, but there will be no trading. It is essentially a digital uh, collectible card game where you, uh, the way they're toting it, is you literally just. Have it, play it, and there. That's it. Like you'll have cards already. Um, there's there's a few modes. One of them which I do like. Uh, we'll talk about in, in a bit. But your event, you're already already going to have cards. There's going to be apparently 300 unique cards at launch. So that's not really that many if you think about a, an entire series of of a card, uh, any card game in the past, right? That's not really that many. So it's going to be a bit uh, basic at first. Probably going to get more diverse as it goes, but uh, you're going to be able to, I don't know how it's going to work exactly, I don't think anyone does, but you're going to be able to buy a $1 per 5 cards, just like a random booster pack of any other game, uh, and or you could slowly earn them through gameplay. The way it works is you'll play a game, and after you beat somebody, or perhaps maybe after you just play a game against another human being, uh, it's going to use Battle.net matchmaking as well, so this is all tied into be Battle.net. Uh, after you play a game, you get a booster, you get a small I think it's three cards, uh, and obviously there'll be some rarity to some, uh, perhaps some, you know, some ones that you don't want, obviously. But one v one games. There's a deck builder, golden versions of the same card. I don't know what that is, uh, but uh, and you could disenchant quote unquote cards that you don't want to receive uh, essentially a token to help you build a new card that perhaps you do want. So these are all features, you know, in terms of... Uh, you can also play versus uh, artificial intelligence to computer, as some of us may may refer to it as, uh, different different difficulty levels. That is that is the announcement. Now let's talk about... I'd like to talk about a bit about the implications now. Okay, let's do that quick. So implications, uh, perhaps, perhaps repercussions, perhaps, dare I say it, inspiration... All right, now this is obviously something that they've been working on in the past. And and just drawing parallels here. Okay, just just drawing parallels. Nothing nothing too concise. Nothing here is is, you know, an insult in any way. But let's talk about this, right? Missa Pandaria pet battle system. What's that? What's that? What's the inspiration for that? You tell me. Okay? I think we know between ourselves. Um upcoming, you know, sometime soon release. Defense of the Ale House was that D O T A. Okay, so perhaps there's uh, perhaps some inspiration for that. What well, you you tell me, I I, I couldn't fathom a guess. Uh, and now, um, Wow Card Game. Uh, yeah, so let's see what what kind of card games are there out there that perhaps favor types of magic and. Uh, and may involve wizards on a, on a on a coast. Um, yeah, I think I think we're we are in agreement. Okay, now 
Uh, this is, in my opinion, uh, this is great. I personally love this decision. If they've spent a good time doing it, they're saying there's going to be 3D fucking backgrounds and spell effects. Now, I have um, a, a trailer, a Blizzard release trailer, that is in the description of this video. I want you guys to watch this at some point. Not now, because I'm fucking talking, okay? But after, there's a time and a place. Listen. Uh, anyway... Fuck it. I mean, it, it's it's legit, okay? If you're a Magic the Gathering fan, if you're ever a trading card game fan, all you ever want is to be able to play with other human beings, right? You can't play alone. It's not possible. It really isn't. Uh, you could try, but you can't. And there's just not a lot of people in, in real life who play these games anymore. So what is this? This is brilliance. It's surely sheer brilliance. Magic has an online thing. I'm not. I'm not going to bash. I'm not going to do anything here. But it's. It's not. It's no. It's. You know what I mean. This is. This is legit. If they can pull this off, I think this will have the most resounding effect of any Blizzard game currently. World of Warcraft obviously is is a hardcore game. You have to play for hours. You get stuff. Progression. All this. But this is something you're going to be able to pick up. This is exactly what I've always wanted for Magic: The Gathering. And Blizzard has taken the idea and incorporated it themselves. The only way it could be any more hilarious is if they just put it in WoW. That would be the only way. I mean, it's effectively a, a WoW game, and I don't even, I can't, I can't even fathom it. But free to play. I mean, this is exactly what we want, isn't it? This is exactly what we want. If it, if it's good, this is going to be probably the most. I don't even have a word for it. This is going to be huge. Let's put it that epic, as they say about 100 times in the trailer. So uh, check that out. Now, I do want to conclude uh, with a few more closing remarks, essentially, and then summate my point and my opinion over all of this. Elapsed opinion? Uh, fucking awesome. Cannot wait. Personally, will definitely love it. I, I've heard, I can guarantee I'll love it. From what I've seen... I mean, it may only be a teaser in some respects, but this is this is awesome. It really is. It's not Warcraft 4, you know what I mean? It's not something that directly affects my gaming experience with other video games, but this is great. I can't wait to see it. I am very much looking forward to the beta. I think it is a ballsy move. Okay, there is no doubt about that. With as much scrutiny of the, as they have received for uh, some World of Warcraft uh, stuff and mostly Diablo stuff, and how shitty StarCraft is. Terrible game. But, um, no. <laughs> I think it's a ballsy move. Because, obviously, this is lucrative, to say the least. And I think they'll fucking swing it the right way. Let's put it that way, man. We'll, we'll see how it goes. We will see, shall we? You know, don't make any non-cognizant decisions about this, please. I beg you. This may be bad, may be good. You don't know yet. But I'm willing to try it. So, I'm looking for a beta key. If I can get my hands on one legitimately, I will. If anyone has one and they're looking to perhaps uh, trade it for um, a, an item of equal quantity or value, <laughs> let me know because I am definitely trying to get this. I want to cover this the fuck out of this on Ace. I want to get videos of this up. I want to talk about the game. I want to look at the game. I want to look at the cards. I want to look at all this stuff. And that is it. Mac, PC, and iPad. How about iPad? Huh? Fuck you. Uh, that is it, I think. I mean, there's going to be a trailer in the description below. I want you guys to check that out, like I said. Uh, and I'd love to hear your opinion. I really would, because this is a... I wouldn't say a polarizing topic. But it's a topic that probably has some people pissed off. And some people in love. So let's hear it. I would love to hear it. Uh, otherwise, I mean, just get fucked. That's all I could... That's the only advice I can give you is to eat a dick. So you guys have a great... A great one. A great meal of that dick. You enjoy it. It's gonna be it's gonna it's gonna be it's gonna be good. I think it's gonna be great. <laughs>